Hi guys, so I'm about to show you another posture which is great for sluggish bowels and overall good digestion. So this one's called caterpillar or forward fold. So we're gonna get straight into it. But if there are again any issues with the back or spine in general, then I'd really just err with caution and use your props as much as you need. And I'm just gonna show you how to use your props in this posture. So again, we're holding this posture anywhere between three to five minutes, and you're just allowing the breath to still, to calm down, to really soften, because that'll help to quieten the mind. So we're just gonna forward fold. If you need to pop a prop underneath your knees because you have tight hamstrings, then the option is to do that. And that looks like this. Another option is to pop the bolster on top of your legs and then forward fold that way. And we're not really reaching out for the toes and struggling with fierce force. We're just gently opening up the body, gently coaxing open the body. So if you can do so, then just forward fold without your bolster just to see where you're at. If this is all you can do, then that's absolutely fine. If you can move a little bit deeper, then just bring the palms, or I should say the backs of the palms, creeping them forward towards your feet and just slowly lowering the head if that's comfortable on the neck, somewhere around your knees. And this really helps to open up through the kidney channel, also the large intestine. We're compressing the intestines here stimulating them and, and increasing their health. And we're nourishing the kidneys, which will also support fatigue. And over time, you can creep the backs of the palms towards the feet even further and just drop the head a little bit further down. If you can, and it's all right on your back, to go a little bit deeper, you can separate the legs. So there's a little bit of a gap between the toes and then just dropping the heart and the chest in between those feet. And when you're ready to come out, just slowly lift your head. And make your Spine nice and erect, so eventually getting there. And then slowly making your way onto your back. You can bend your knees if you like, especially if there's any issues with that lower back or it's a little bit tender today. And then just resting in this rest posture for one to two minutes. And sometimes you might feel a little bit tender a little bit vulnerable and fragile in certain areas. That's completely normal. It's actually a good thing. So that's it. That's my other posture that I often use for improving bowel movements and getting on top of sluggish bowels. Give it a try. Let me know what you think.